Welcome back, everybody, to another episode of my Hogwarts Legacy Let's Play. Professor Fig is gone. He is going somewhere. I forget where he said he was going. He needs to go talk to somebody about George's death. We're kind of just on our own then without him, so we can kind of go do whatever we want. I'm not tracking any specific quests, so let's see what we've got going on. We can go exploring a little bit. We can go do more spell combos to get better at fighting people. I don't think that's a bad idea. Oops, I didn't even track it, did I? I'm gonna go try my best, we'll see how this is doing. I think my uh, filter might be a little too low for my mic. Sometimes it doesn't pick me up saying things, but I don't know, it's not terrible, I guess. I wanna figure out how to get my lock level up because I wanna go into all these doors. Hello, Lucan. I'd like to practice with the- Excellent idea. Yes, let me go some perform a basic cast three times. Okay, so. Two. Three spells, four and one. Okay, so boom. One, two, three, four, one. Got it, okay. It's like playing um old school, not Mortal Kombat, Street Fighter. Like the spell combos before the dummy scratch, so it's gonna be four hit one, and then we'll see. So boom, boom, one, two, three, two, one, two, three. Ah. I don't have it. Ah. I don't. It wasn't fully charged. Do I gotta go slower? Do I gotta take my time with it? Boom. 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 One. Two. Three. Two. One. Two. Three. Boom. Boom. One. Two. Three. Finally got it. Only took me three tries. Oh my goodness. Come on, man. You know better than that. Alright. What else we got going on? Should we go to class? I feel like following the main story just all the way through isn't fun. I want to do some of the side stuff. Just stupid. Okay. I am going to walk there just so I can uh, kind of get a look at everything else in the castle. I always fast travel everywhere, so I never get a look at the beauty of this game just sad yeah okay wait Rebellion. what do i do with it oh it feels like that page uh he's slender quite proud of himself for just cuz i like it fair enough dude Rebellion. do what i can't find Ooh, something else magical what does it do shoot it hmm Is it, is it a painting? There's nothingness. Is it a mirror? It doesn't work. Who knows what it is? Who knows what it does? Not me. Five minutes later. But look at that. I made a whole trip out of it. There's something in there. I just Hey, know it's it. Lenora. Hello, Lenora. What are you looking at? Everyone thinks I'm utterly balmy. Samantha thinks I'm potty. But it's this painting. I never noticed it before. If I know Hogwarts, and I do, an empty frame doesn't appear for no reason. I just saw one of those. I know there's other like this. Have you gained any insights about the painting since you've been studying it? Well, how do you gain insight? I did insight? discover that casting Lumos has an effect of some kind. Okay, cool. So let's go back to that other one. I've been... Shut up. I don't care. Let me go to the other one. Go the painting secret. The oh, I don't have Lumo. Is it this one? Lumos. That spot must okay. be a clue. There, 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 there. This looks like a location from the painting. I saw. What could be so special about it? Let's see. Is that it? Statue of Gregory. Found the location. But what does it mean? Lumos. Oh. Let's get you back to your frame, little moth. Oh. Let's go, moth. Take you back to your thing. Okay, and then I, I need. Knew there was a connection. I Got it. Tell Lenora that I solved the puzzle of that empty frame. Good, tell Lenora. I've come like it's so many pages. Figured it out, stupid. Lenora, I solved the mystery of that painting. You did? How? Magic. Duh. I'm a wizard. Well, I saw another one of those paintings 
little bit ago. Let me see if I can go find it again. I don't remember where it was. So many secrets. Ooh. This. Reveal. Okay. Open. Um. Um. It has to be something to do with these, but... But what? On that thing. Thirteen question mark snake. Um I don't know. It doesn't make any sense. I'd better keep an eye on high places around the Ooh. school for Zenobia's gobstones. Revelio. High places. Like that? Accio. Well, that's one of Zenobia's gobstones. Nice. I hardly see what all the fuss is about. Because I'm new here. I don't know anything. What does this do? Bye. Leviosa. Oh. So that's what these do. Kill the guide page. How do I get in here? Hmm. How do I get my lock picking up, guys? Let's see. So if I go... Balance. Ugh, I have to get through the main story. Okay. Maybe I should just go to class. Oh, wait. I got more gear. Let's put on some... Just some, let's get some gear on. Uh, let's see. Go back. I had a hat that I wanted to wear. Where is it? Yes! <laughs> Perfect! I love it. Ooh. Better... Better scarf. Or a vest. The better vest? No. This one, look, this one is better, but it doesn't look as cool. So I'm gonna change the appearance back to this one. I like the way it looks. And this hat, I'm not sure about it, but... Oh, we'll keep it for now, I guess. What do you got for me, Teach? Ooh, long hair. Sebastian. He's in this class too. Nice. Professor Garlic. Oh, Lenora. It is to see you again, Lenora dear. Oh, here. You'll need these for today's class. Uh, um, uh, a little treat for your auntie. What? Oh, hello. Class, please welcome the newest rose in our garden. Next, I have red hair like you. They call me a rose. We do look forward to growing together. Hmm. Oh, okay. Whatever you say. To have everyone back he didn't together. say a word. What a weirdo. Now then, today we will be acquainting ourselves with the mellifluous tuber. The what? The mandrake root. Mandrake root. Let's go. He says it so less aggressively than my character does. Let's see if we can't make our fibrous friends a bit more comfortable, shall we? First, let's protect our ears. What? What? Now, everyone. Grip the mandrake by the tendrils and give it a firm tug. Okay. Oh. Oh, it screams. Oh, God. What? Why does it scream? I'm very sorry about that. Yours was a bit mature, I'm afraid. That's okay. Right, then. Hmm. I wonder if hippogriffs like nutgrass. Nutgrass. Yes, Professor. Firstly, well done with your mandrake. They can be rather difficult to get a grasp of. Uh, yeah, he was freaking loud. I'll say, I nearly went deaf. Well, yes, of course, the cry of a mature mandragora can be fatal. Oh so my god! Is, plant the seeds there now, and you can okay. return to harvest them later. Even with soil, sunlight, and a bit of magic, they will take. There's not a spell to, to like make plants grow immediately. Didn't that guy do that earlier? My staff Whatever. Go to my this area. Small planter. Boom. Didn't he? Ten minutes. As you all should know from Professor Dang. Sharp's class. Well done. Once it can be harvested, your Dittany will be ready to use in Wigan Weld potion. I'll let Professor Sharp tell you about it. Professor that. Sharp. Now, all right. what say we branch out? Introduce you to a different sort of flora. The Chinese chomping cabbage. So we gotta go meet. Leander, he's gonna go. We're gonna go do something. Saw you on your way to Hogsmeade the other day. 
Nice to meet you. Any other green house? I'll be showing what? you the Chinese chomping cabbages. Up these stairs will take us there. Okay. But your lead. Of course, my lead. Nice I'm the best. Defense against the dark arts, by the way. Thanks. I'm the best. Go on. Grab a few of those cabbages. Now, see that dummy? Okay. Just toss the cabbages at it. And they'll do the rest. Hold tab and open the tool. Oh, whoa! What? Nice. Look at what? This. They'll chomp on anything they can get their uh, mouths on. Wow. Mum planted some in her garden last year to keep the gnomes out. Did save her the denoming, but they left her honking daffodils in tatters. Trolls in hogsmeade and such. You can't be above throwing a cruciferous vegetable if necessary. Well, Dogweed in death cap has more of them, if you're keen. You get the idea. Anyway, we uh, probably ought to head back to class. Yeah, that's what I came here to do, man. I was learn how to do Take stuff. I'll see you back in class. Terribly sorry, Mr. Clopton. I tend Mr. To Clopton? Cabbages, Professor. What kind of name is Mr. Clopton? I'm gonna plant do it like five minutes. That's what I'm talking about. Those are really relishing their new pots. Only cost me my damned hearing. Ah, sucks to suck, but... Okay. New quests. Let's see what we got going on. Potions class, yeah. Actually, let's go... Hang out with Natty. Let's go see what she wants. She's been waiting for a while. Wow, that is so far away. There you are. The cross one's duelist to beat. You're right, man. I am the best. Look at me and my stupid hat. Wah! Shoot that thing. I don't even know if he's giving me, but I want it. Moonstone. What is moonstone? Dude, we're gonna collect all the plants and stuff so I can make cool stuff and potions. And then I can grow cool stuff. Leaping toast will catch the Shrooms. Got it. Boom. Collect all the moon rocks. Moonstone. Whatever. Same thing. Rock, stone. Who cares? Dwayne the rock, Dwayne the stone. Same difference. Where were we at? We were exploring. There was supposedly a page around here, but I don't see it. Oh, there it is. What is this? Uh, groundskeeper's tools. One might surmise that this set of tools could be enchanted. So, is, so what does that mean? Does that mean I'm going to be able to have like a hut or something? What does this rock area back here mean? So, I collect these. So, I'm guessing I need to move this to over here. Okay. Okay, drag it. Now leave it. So now is this going to open? Or... Incendium. Is that on fire? Oh, there, okay. Makes sense. Look at me using... Um... Intellect. Uh, light up real quick. In the world. I hope I don't... I don't want to see anything creepy down here. Oh, there's a chest. Okay. Is there Rebellion. anything else in here that I should be... Lumos. Looking for? Is that it? Just the chest? And whatever this is? Okay. Um... So I went into a cave to get some glasses. Sick, dude. Oh, and the resets itself. Okay. Get that before it's I do anything. So now I can fast out. You too, homie. Hello, How you been? How are you? I hope you've recovered from our rather eventful trip to Hogsmeade. It's been I so will. long since then, man. I don't even worry about her. You, my friend. What? With Ranrock and Rookwood and Harlow after you? I'm all right at the moment. We did not speak about it at the time. But I am hoping now you might tell me why they were looking for you. Ah. Uh, yeah, I'll tell her. They She's cool. Something that Professor Fig and I found at Gringotts. When were you at Gringotts? A long time Just ago. Just before we came to Hogwarts. In fact, it's why I was late to the sorting ceremony. Correct. A port key brought us there after the dragon attacked our carriage. What on earth? There's one more thing. It's a bit odd, if I'm honest. Mm -hmm. Professor Fig says I have a rare connection to a powerful form of ancient magic. Is that the magic you used fighting the trolls in Hogsmeade? Yes. I think so. I I'm still learning, but I can see traces of it, and I've cast magic I can't otherwise explain. True. I, I have been casting some weird stuff sometimes, it's man. I'm not even going to lie to you. 
and I will have more questions. Okay, that's fine. For now, it is safe to say. Yeah, there are threat. Let's get through it. What do you realize? You displayed such courage fighting that troll, and Serona wasn't intimidated one bit by Rookwood and Harlow. Correct. Both of you have inspired me to take a stand of my own. All right, what's what your stand? Men like Rookwood and Harlow are the reason my mother and I left Matibili land. I am not going to sit by and watch them destroy my nation. Oh, yeah, let's go! Let's do it. Good. Rookwood and Harlow are a dangerous pair. And the fact that they're working with Ranrock, well... All the more reason they must be stopped. Rumor has it that Theophilus Harlow runs Rookwood's day-to-day -day operations. Taking him down would cripple Rookwood's entire enterprise. That may be true. But shouldn't Officer Singer handle someone like Harlow? I spoke with her. She was polite, but perhaps understandably would not discuss details with a student. I overheard some of Rookwood's lot talking about a massive poaching operation that Harlow was planning. I was thinking that we could investigate a bit, try to get the evidence that Officer Singer needs. All right, but how? I am going to watch and listen, find out precisely what Harlow is up to. I shall reach out when I know more. In the meantime, remember, I am here if you need me. Thank you, Natty. I beg your pardon. How dare you threaten me? What's going on here? Where? Go fight these people. What they are they come this way. Think. Hey. I've no idea who it is you think I might have seen. I've been busy with my research. Leave this old lady alone. I do not have time to. Victor Rookwood, don't give a doxy's nip back your time. Oi. Speak of the devil. All right. Mr. Rookwood would like a word with you. I don't care. A student, you can't be so <sighs> Hey! Get that at you. Leave her alone. Stop it. Stop it. Got him. Gone, gone, gone. Gone. Boom. Got him. All over. Weak. Uh-oh. It's somebody. Oh, in a top hat. Oh, what's the light go out of your Whoa. eyes? Oh, she is nothing there. Got him. Got him. Did I? I think you might have, bro. What on earth just happened? I've never been accosted in such a manner. Been so close to Hogwarts. They hate me, man. They just want to kill me. I'm just that cool. I am, thanks in no small part to your excellent defensive skills. Thank you, Nora. Care to tell me why two Ashwinders were ready to dispatch me to get to you? Ashwinders? Victor Rookwood's thieves and extortionists, his little cronies. They seemed quite keen on you. It's a long story, but thank you for your help. Hmm. Well, you've avoided them for the moment. For the Pretty moment? They're gonna... They're like mercenaries, mercenaries then. Best get oh, on I got like a bounty on my head for return. from Workwood, man. Merlin attended Hogwarts, you know, and I'm studying some curious fixtures he left here Ooh, centuries shitty. ago. Fixtures? What? These vine-covered pillars, dozens of them all around the area. I've taken to calling them the Trials, Trials of, of Merlin. Merlin. I believe he created them as a diversion for his fellow Slytherins. <laughs> he was terribly fond of puzzles and enigmas. What does this? Okay, fascinating. All right. Love them. Now go here. Notice the vines on these pillars here, oh. as well as a stone swell on the ground. Yeah. Each trial has these features. Place the mallow sweet on the swell, and we'll see what happens. Hopefully, she's correct. On. Um. Come on. Whoa. My word. Did you see that? The vines disappeared. Sure did. What should I do now? Set it on fire. The flames make the pyre sink. Yeah. I am curious about these pyres. So do I need to burn all of them? Incendio. I'm guessing. Oh, what? Do I have to get them all in a certain amount of time? Now I got all three. Oh, I didn't mean to do that. So. Whoa, whoa! That's cool looking. Whoa! It's cool looking. I did something. She's gonna be so happy! Yeah! This looks like a grandma. It's cool. 
the dark out. Can indeed. However, I now have even more questions. Even more. How does it work? Well, I think each has those telltale vines and the swirl on the ground. You should feel free to solve them as you come across them. Okay. My guess is that each will also require mallow suit. Probably. Which you can find in Hogsmeade. I really must be off. Such a pleasure to meet you. You too, ladies. She was nice. Okay, but and do just remember here. that I have plants in my biology class, and I need to go get those. Different challenges offer different rewards. I didn't read that. Complete Merlins get cool rewards, I'm guessing, pretty much. Okay, but gotta go check on my plant. He's ready. It's back. And then another one. So now, if I go to potions, I can make a health potion. It's called Spadoogadoogie. I don't remember what it's called. Let me jump over the ledge. Whoa! What? Not fun. I'm gonna attempt that every single time, and one of these times, the game's gonna patch, and they're gonna let me jump over. Maybe not. I don't know. They probably don't want that. Oh, someone from the ministry guarding the school after the incident in Hogsmeade. No, there shouldn't be, because I took them down. And if I can do it, we can all do that. Make some healing potions. Who are you? Old looking. Potions is one of the most challenging and hazardous subjects taught at this school. As fifth years, you will be required to reach new heights of both discipline and intellect. Before today's class is completed, each of you will have brewed okay. a Wigan Weld potion. I could have told, I could have told him that. Home. You never know when you might need it. Please begin. He doesn't even tell us how to make it. He's just like, good luck. Sounds like school. Okay, so what do I got to do? Use a strong, even motion when crushing your ingredients. Please okay. be meticulous when adding powder to your potions. Pinch. One errant sneeze could be disastrous. A little bit of that. Uh -huh. Might be too much there, man. There's a lot of droplets. It's a big old spoon. Just checking on this weirdo. I see most of you have not forgotten how to stir. How did you forget how to stir? Look at me! Hmm. Not an easy potion to brew. Well done. Thank you. And from what I hear of your recent exploits in Hogsmeade, you'd also do well to practice brewing the defensive Edurus potion. Okay. Professor Weasley had you acquire the recipe from Jay Pippins, correct? Correct. Yes, sir. Good. For the moment, you can find the ingredients you need in my office. But in the future, you'll be expected to provide your own ingredients. Okay, so herbology can be Some important to this. can be harvested from the plants you grow in your herbology class, and rarer ones can be purchased. Others, however, may be harder to obtain, and will require you to be a bit more resourceful. So, and running so around finding them myself, growing. resourceful, and what it means is being a hunter-gatherer, pretty much. Summer. I hear Professor Sharp say that you have permission to go into his office. Of course. He did say that. He wants me to get more ingredients to brew another potion. Brilliant! You, my friend, have been presented okay. with an extraordinary Gareth Weasley. opportunity. Gareth Weasley. I'm Gareth, by the way. Gareth Weasley. I simply need a single fupa feather. As you'll mm. already be in Sharp's office with his permission, perhaps you could grab it for me. I don't know, man. I don't know, Gareth. I don't want to get on Sharp's bad side. Me either, dude. You won't. Fupa feathers aren't that valuable. I don't believe you. Sharp won't even miss it. Yeah, whatever. I have enough to worry about collecting the ingredients he wants me to get. Correct. I understand. Sorry about it, Weasley, but I can't. Can't do it, boy. Okay, so. Looper. I don't know about non valuable, man. That thing looks pretty valuable. It's only got like three of them. Right there. I'm not taking it. No, I'm better than that. stations organized and free of no. Professor Sharp must have learned a lot during his time as an aura. I wish he talked about it. What's an aura? Oh, just station on. Alright, cool. Bam. Burning time 30 seconds. Alright, cool. So. And now we add the mallow sweet. And that's odd. What's happening? 
Wait, okay. It's not supposed to. Uh, yeah, good thing I didn't get in that potion. Oh my goodness, dude. Dragon dog. What happened? <laughs> well done, Gary. Idiot. Edoras potion, I whatever. Edoras potion. Edoras, yeah! Glad you managed Knocked to it. stay Got on it. task. Mm. Not every class is so eventful. For real. I saw Mr. Weasley speaking with you earlier. He can be quite persuasive. Glad you managed to resist. Thank you, Professor Sharp. You've done well today. I confess I was skeptical given the advanced nature of this class and the fact you're a new student. Fair enough. I'm glad I was able to meet your expectations. A rare occurrence. Pay particular attention in herbology. The plants you nurture there are often essential to the potions you brew. Well, here. yeah, that would make now, sense. I recommend that you find a safe location in which to practice brewing. You cannot leave a hot cauldron simply anywhere. Correct. That'll be all. Okay, he just don't look at will be all. Alright, dude, you got it, you got it. Of us has had enough excitement for one day. Class is dismissed. Game wants me to talk to I this person. I was impressed that you were able to answer Professor Sharp's question about the Wicked Meld potion. Oh, you're the new student. Hello, I've Amit. much about you. Um, thank you. I'm Amit, by the way. Amit. Uh, pleasure. Truly. You look nice, dude. And I've never seen anyone brew such a flawless Wiganweld potion on their first try. Well done. Thank you. I'm glad I was able to get it right the first time. You must simply have a knack for potion recipes. I don't know about all Some that. Some students seem so confounded by potion recipes, it's as if they're written in gobbledygook. Yeah. A fascinating language. <laughs> what language? You know there, really, but I am a self-taught speaker. No. Merlin's beer, Fair. good conversation. A portrait in our common room wants to talk to you. What? It's Eldritch Diggory. He used to be the minister for magic, I think. Diggory? I know that name. We're going to do that. So let's go... Travel to the common room real quick. Do what this painting wants. Didn't think I'd ever say that in my life. Let's go see what this painting wants, you guys. This painting wants to talk to me. We're gonna have a nice conversation here with a painting. It's Harry Potter's world, so everything makes sense for a reason. Hello, painting man. What's up? Hello, Eldritch Diggory. You wanted to see me, sir. Indeed. Allow me to introduce myself. So few students know who I am these days. Eldridge Diggory. Hello. Former Minister for Magic and founder of the Aura Recruitment Program at your service. My service. I believe you can help solve a decades old murder thanks to that book you found and, in particular, its missing pages. How do you know about that? How do you know about the book and the pages? We portraits here more than you might suspect and most of us can keep a secret. So, <laughs> I'd say you. Surely a Hufflepuff such as yourself would be inclined to help seek long overdue justice. Justice must be Don't served! Yeah! Wonderful. Wonderful. Like a wizard cop. I am pleased to have been right about you. Thank you, Eldritch. My niece, Helen Thistlewood, can provide you with details. She's retired now, but was a skilled aura in her day. What's an aura? The unsolved murder of which I speak was her case. I often visit my portrait in her home, in the nearby hamlet of Upper Hogsfield. Shall I tell her to expect you? Hmm. I shall go and see her right away. Not right away, but I'll go see her at some point. <laughs> Lie to you, but her keen mind. Both mysteries may be solved sooner than you think. All right, cool. I shall see you there soon. I hope. Not soon, because that's the end of it. I do appreciate you guys tuning in, listening, watching, whatever you're doing. And I'll see you all next time. Oh, you've made a great mistake. Oh.